You were right. Obviously, you were right. I only questioned it because I knew how much that farm would mean to you. And that's the only reason? What did you just say? I'm sorry, I... I don't even know why I said that. Uh, Andy, I'm trying to make things right. Here we are again, as soon as Robert shows his face. Look how we're acting. Exactly. I... I don't think I can do this. But talk about overreacting. Do what? Did you mean us? No, I... I mean working for them. I should have just kept out of his way rather than trying to be... Whatever. What are you going to do? I don't care how much money they've got. I want out before it's too late. Not answering. Morning, Dad. You OK? You look a little bit... Knackered. You're not sleeping? No big deal. At my age, it's not waking up you've got to worry about. I'll phone him again in five minutes. And he's late for work. Robert's taking it personally. It's not his job to worry about that. I don't know why he's poking his nose in. He's trying to help. We all need to muck in if we want to make a success of this place. The stuff about my brother you don't know. I know you're the one acting like a child. Perhaps. But I'm not the one who has to see a shrink about my temper. Yeah? Been quick to use his fists before. See? Got a lot to learn about Golden Boy. Do you know about this? He hasn't uh, said anything, has he? Been in touch at all? Or... He got the muscles, I got the work ethic. You know, I don't think it would do either of you any harm to take the day off as well. I'll give him half an hour and then I'm gonna go and knock on his door. Leave him be. He'll be in soon enough. I mean, it's up to you, of course, but uh, it seems a bit over the top. Uh... Jacob, you can't... Nice of you to show up. Don't start. Don't start. Hey, I'm not the one rolling in it. Oh, oh, look at that. Almost break time. Skillfully done. Where are you going? Do you want your work schedule or what? Where's Lawrence? Why? Something been said? Look, just tell me where he is. Well, he's through there. But he's in a meeting. He doesn't want to be disturbed. Look, if you're messing me about... I'm not messing you about. He's with Victoria. Looks like her ship's coming in all. Get this thing away! A girl died here. I read about that. Killed by her best friend or something. Did you know her? Did you know her mate? Hey! It just does See you in a second. I'll just park the car up. Vic! Who are you doing skulking about? What did he want? Some spectacularly amazing news as it happens. Wants me to cook for him. What are you on about? A catering deal with Home Farm. Catering for events, shoots, all the posh stuff that you don't get to go to. Cool or what? And it shows Marlon and all, doesn't it? Teach him to slag off me mini tartlets. Here he is. She told you her news? We were just going to have a drink to seal the deal. Robert said you were looking for me. Uh, why don't you join us? Later. I'll, I'll catch you later. Suit yourself. Just us. Sit down. All right, we'll talk it through, see where we get. I know what I've got, and I'm not working for you anymore. I need to know something. My proposal, whatever, uh, favour... You hear what I just... I need to know it won't go any further. It's in all our best interests to get along. All our interests? Genius. You can't buy me, you can't buy Katie, so you go for my sister? This isn't about flaming cooking. What do you want to... Victoria got the job on her merits. Don't underestimate her. But if you go and blow all this up, who knows what'll be left after that? 
Catering will be the last thing on the list of priorities. I'm going. Yours. What if I said you could have the farm anyway? No favours, no strings. Ah, all right. Get what you want. Kind of. School uniform shopping. Say hello to my grandson, Lachlan. You all right? This is Andy, Robert's brother. You don't look like him. I'm adopted. Yeah, thought so. You behaving yourself? Yes, we've been putting the world to rights, haven't we, Andy? Well, think it through. I'll give you a buzz. <laughs>